Okay, it's an absolute mess on my table. But here, this is what we're gonna be talking about today. So this is the PGY Tech quick release, uh, snap lock system, whatever you wanna call it. Really good design. I'm gonna be talking about these and why uh, you'll find these actually really useful, especially for photographers, uh, even videographers with the light system like your, you know, your Sony's mirrorless cameras, A7S III's, A7 III's, A7R IV's, whatever is out there at the moment. These are really good design. GoPro, GoPro Hero 10. No, this is the nine, it's not the 10. But it can be really good for the GoPro Hero 10. So yeah, let's go in depth with these and talk about why you might actually need these and why this can actually help you create better content. Let's get it. <music> What's going on my friends? My name is Jason. I hope you're all doing absolutely fantastic. If you're new to my channel, please consider subscribing. Uh, but uh, let's get into this video. So this is about the PGY Tech quick release systems. Now let's talk about this one first. This is the Arca Swiss plate. Now a lot of companies haven't actually done this with their quick release system and put an Arca Swiss plate at the bottom. This is so handy for photographers, especially when you actually have a tripod that's got the Arca Swiss plate on there. You can put this directly in there and detach your camera really, really fast. It just makes it so much easier, but you can actually pair this with the camera bag strap. Now this is really great as well, slides in, locks in as well. Both of these have the design where you can lock it in and then you've got a safety latch right here where it won't fall out. You can't press that button and you can't pull it out, which is really good. Gives you a little bit of peace of mind. But the great thing about this base plate right here as well, it has a quarter 20 mount at the bottom, but not just that, you can screw that quarter 20 mount adapter out and you've got a 3 8 mount. So this can actually attach to a whole bunch of different tripods as well. Such a good design. A lot of other companies haven't actually done this and I don't know why, uh, but PGY Tech have done a really great job. By the way, PGY Tech did send me these. No, I'm not affiliated with them and I'm not told to say what, uh, what they want. I am brutally honest in a lot of my videos. It's so brutal that some companies don't actually wanna work with me anymore. This is never an easy video to make. But I am honest and uh, I want to tell you guys the truth of the products that I actually have on this channel. And uh, yeah, these are really, really good. Now, this bag strap right here is a really good design as well. I've got the, is it Ulanzi and Folkcam one? Uh, this does seem to be a little bit better quality. The great thing is, is that you can easily change the, if you have a thicker bag, you can easily change the strength of uh, the thickness and how hard it clips on. It's, look, look at these close-ups. It's really, really good design. It has three different thickness levels that you can actually clip it into. Such a good design. And same thing again, you can use the exact same base, slide it in, and then you've got that safety locking mechanism. So you can't press that button and it won't fall out. This is really, really good, especially for photographers, street photographers, hiking, videographers that actually go hiking, GoPro users, boom. This is a GoPro mount as well. Same sort of thing. It has your standard PGY Tech locking mechanism where you put it in, rotate it clockwise, lock it down and then it can go onto that exact same base plate or it can go onto that bag strap as well, which is really good. Uh, especially if you do wanna do your first person uh, point of view with the GoPro attached onto your bag strap. So good to have that. And then you can just quickly release it out if you wanna, you know, put it onto maybe the tripod. Put it onto a gimbal, whatever. However you wanna be shooting, this makes it so, so much easier. Now, one of the great designs about the bases right here, and I don't, once again, I don't know why so many companies or other companies haven't actually done this, but uh, you can actually tighten this with an Allen key. So this one has a flat head part as well, but the Allen key is so crucial because I've stripped a couple of these bases and uh, you obviously have to replace them because it just gets so annoying. You strip them, you try and tighten them with the flat head and you can't actually tighten it because you've stripped it. But the Allen key, 
I mean, whoever strips an Allen key part, I don't even know if that's physically possible because it slots in, it's like a little hex thing. Is it a hex? Is that what you call it? Hex is six? Allen key? Anyway. Something like that. But uh, these are really handy and it's a, such a really good design there. Now the thing about this GoPro one, it, has, it is on a ball joint and you can tighten it at the bottom with a Allen key system is there. Um, and then it swivels around. So if you do have it on your back strap, you can actually twist it and move it around however you want. Great for the GoPro, especially with the horizon leveling as well. So it's gonna keep that horizon nice and level. So uh, this is the last one right here. Now this is a, uh, I don't know what do they call it, a monitor tilt swivel mount thing. You'll find this a lot with a lot of uh, monitors. So putting this onto your hot shoe or it does have a quarter 20 mount at the bottom. Uh, and then it has obviously the quick release plate at the top. Now I haven't found too much use for this one as I have with these other three, the bag strap, the base plate, and the GoPro mount. This one, I don't really find myself demounting my monitor as fast, but you can still use this with your GoPro as well. So if you do have a tripod mount at the GoPro, you can chuck it on here, and then you can put this directly onto your camera's hot shoe or a cold shoe, and you've got that first person view of shooting uh, whatever content you're actually shooting. So that's really good to use. Uh, you can obviously put your Osmo Pocket in, on there as well, onto the camera. Uh, it really depends on what you actually use this for. Like I said, I don't actually have too much use for a quick release system like this. Uh, but nonetheless, if you did have um, a use for this, it's handy to have a quick release system rather than just a solid uh, swivel tilt mount thing. But overall, really good quality from PGY Tech. They are a metal design, a full metal design. There's no plastic parts in here except for this GoPro uh, a finger mount thing. It's your standard plastic like you will get with the GoPros. But other than that, all the rest of it is absolute metal and it's a really solid design. I would actually trust this, and I'm not just saying that because they gave it to me, but I would really trust this with my A7S3 onto it. Well, don't have the A7S3 before anymore, but uh, if I did, I'd trust this on my bag. Uh, even my A7 III, even my A6000, chucking it onto the bag. <sighs> just can't believe how quick and easy that is. Makes it so handy, so good. But yeah, anyway, what do you guys think? Comment below, I'd really like to know your thoughts on quick release systems. Do you have another quick release system? Um, I'd really like to know what you actually have, if you've you know, used some of these before. But uh, yeah, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. That would be absolutely amazing. Subscribe to my YouTube channel if you already haven't. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. All right, thanks for watching. Let's get it.